The letters left were within my name. I could feel something rewriting me, taking control. This voice, it seems like it was forgotten a long time ago. Very familiar. I, I swear I know it from somewhere. A time before I existed. No, no, no. It's not a voice I should recognize. It's Joseph? That doesn't feel right, though. This appears to be my final message. For all it was worth, I had a blast. But now... It's the end of Dark Knight Flyer. Owen, oh, Floppy, please take care of Joseph Knight Flyer for me. You're about to get a lot more lonely. Goodbye. <laughs> Man, Joe should be here by now. I've been waiting for so long that I don't even know if it's the 21st yet or not. To be honest, I don't even correctly remember the last time I made a video. Was it before Halloween or did I make one this morning? It's like something has to be up if I'm this uncertain about the last time I made a video. Or maybe I'm just... So scared to tell Joe that I've won. Since the contract stated, And look at us now! 25 subscribers on my end, 50 on his end. Funny. He seemed to have like some control for a while, and rescheduled some of his older videos, but they ended up bringing down his subscriber count. I kind of feel bad for him. It won't matter soon. What the fuck is this? Who are you? Some people would like to mess with others and say that I'm just some voice inside your little head. But in reality, I'm real, I'm physical, and I am you. Fuck off! You are not me. How the fuck are you inside my head? Because I am you, dear Nightflyer, or more like, you are me. A broken version of me, if I'm being honest. Wait, what? Let me tell you something, Dark. Over the course of this year, this kind of talk happened with Constructo Derno too. He was all confused and couldn't believe that what he had heard. That's why he went back to you. And start questioning himself. I found this very moving that I thought I should go back and tell my little broken pawn that he's a worthless version of me. There's no way there are more people like me and Joe. How come me and him were the only two people in existence that could understand the contract? Wow, you are really gullible, aren't you? How can you believe that a piece of paper, or however you imagined it, could actually have a voice. That was me, you stupid piece of shit. Wow, it really was worth waiting all this time to start putting my plan into action. What plan? Mm, Alright, I'll tell you since I was meant to explain all of this in the first place anyway. A long time ago, back on the Joseph Knight Flyer channel, Joseph was playing a game. Whilst playing this game, he created me as a little gag to humour the video from the state he was in. But once he took back the video and continued to play the game, he forgot all about me. It's safe to say that at this time period, 
that characters for the channel were being made as the years went on. Take for example, Papa Pyrocynical. Originally, I thought he was going to be forgotten by Joe. Because he was a character created by him to be thrown out after one little gag. It turns out though, that this character just kept getting used. Again, and again, and again, and again. I can't understand it. What made this fucking guy so special that he got to go back? <clears throat> Sorry, I almost lost it there. I hope you see where I'm going with this. I know he has some other characters that haven't come back either, but they... They were older characters, something that a younger Joe wouldn't have been able to understood at the time. And some of them probably still walk the empty glitchy halls between these rooms. Alright, what's the deal then? If you really want Joe, then go after him on the 21st. That'll be the perfect time to get back at him. Oh, Dark, that wouldn't be any fun at all. Excuse me? You see, I've been waiting, creating, and recreating this plan for over five years now. It'd be an awful waste to just dump it instantly by killing him off. So I decided, because this channel has a great potential, I'll take it from you. I'll leave this room locked from the empty glitchy halls between these rooms and lock Joseph out forever. You can't do this. The contract was so strong, it stopped me when I tried to attack Joe. But has he ever tried to attack you? A person with greater power than you? Me and Joe can kill you, Joe just hasn't figured it out yet. So that's why, if the only other person that can kill me is outside and stays locked outside this room, ding, ding, ding. Leave the threat outside the room. Joe will always find a way. He's interacted with me over the last two years, even though he technically shouldn't have. Of course he has. He has the power over you. And maybe enough power to overthrow my fake contract. Anyway, Dark, it was nice knowing you. Nice knowing what I would have been like if I were a pussy a useless idiot that can't ever understand the proper vengeance I seek and a mistake that was never meant to exist. Joe! Do say that much about poor Joseph Nightflyer, but Dark has a point. What if he does come after me? What if he kills me? Well, I guess that won't really be a problem, will it? Hmm. Seems I'm the jungle master here. Seems I I'm in control. But anyway, thank you for joining me today. Now, I better go. Gotta celebrate Christmas, you know? But in the meantime, Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year to everyone who's watching. Bye bye. <laughs> Those what a kindness. Nice.
smile on my face. Ah. <laughs>